that I want to drug you. Tante, I can't, I can't even believe that you would suggest something like that. Look, you were the last person I remember seeing in Jake's. Then we end up half naked on my sofa just in time for Lulu to see us. And you think that I would have to drug you to make that happen? I have to ask. I should have, I should have known. I should have known when you were hitting on me, but... I got confused, and... You were so sincere, I just... I believed you. I really believed you. Look, the fact that Maxie and Lulu, they think the worst, that makes sense. But I expected so much more coming from you. Oh, look, I'm not attacking you here. I don't usually have to drug guys to get them in bed with me, okay, Dante. Okay, I'm sorry. I know, it, I know it looks bad. But I thought that we were so much closer than this. You know, Jake's is a dive. I mean, you got there before me, maybe someone put something in your drink and you handed it off to me by mistake. I should've known. I just should've known when you had this complete change of heart. How complete? You told me that you didn't realize how much you cared about me until you saw me all grown up. Couldn't you tell there was something wrong with me? Yeah, you seemed a little loose, but you sounded fine. I thought that when you said you wanted to be with me, it was because you really wanted to be with me. Did you think about Lulu at all? I was drunk. I was drunk, obviously. I wasn't thinking straight, and you were so convincing. And I, I see that everything that you said then was just the drugs talking, but Dante, I mean, we have been so close for so long now, and you have to know that I would never do anything to hurt you. Come on, please, tell me you know that much. I'm, I'm such a jerk. I hurt Lulu, and now I'm hurting you by saying that you did the worst possible thing. I'm sorry. Me too. Look, let's, um, let's just forget about this. Hey, that shouldn't be so hard for you. <laughs> Sorry. What's your name? Again? <laughs> no. Yeah, you're right. No, look, I, uh, you obviously didn't slip anything into my drink, and I can't believe I even suggested it in the first place. So are we cool friends again? Yeah, we'll always be friends. Let's just put this behind us and move on. Okay. Brooklyn's always been a little bit wild, okay? And I. What's what's Morgan in for? We like them. And also for uh, torturing the Zakara warehouse. No way, on his first night out of prison. <laughs> well, he didn't waste much time getting back to work. He was with his girlfriend. He's friends with Johnny. Why would he burn down his warehouse? Well, somebody did. Now, what, what is it with you and these guys? What is it with, with me and, what, organized crime? <laughs> Is it me and, and the job that I'm supposed to be doing? And the badge that I wear? You can't arrest people without probable cause. You know, you got it way too deep when you were undercover. You missed all kinds of chances to put your old man away. Look, if, if you don't think you could think like a cop anymore, maybe it's time you do something else. It hurts all of us when you bring these guys in for no reason. It makes us look ridiculous. So what do you want to do? Should I release them? Uh -huh. Innocent until proven guilty. Isn't that the basis of our justice system? And what about perjury? Huh? What about all the times that you covered for your old man when you were supposed to put him in jail? Look, if you don't think that you could do the job anymore, you should just have the decency to turn in your badge. You should talk to Ronnie. Where's Diane? Position a judge. Must be a unique experience for her, you being uh, innocent for once. Look, Santos Lopez thinks Johnny murdered his brother. We both know that's on Sunny. This thing between them is getting pretty ugly. Who knows when it's gonna stop and who's gonna die? Ronnie dragged Michael in here. Do you know that? He took him off the road crew as a way to mess with me. I'll make sure that doesn't happen. Well, I thought you were supposed to be watching out for Michael. I'm doing the best I can, but I could use a little help here. 
Do something to stop this war before it starts. Sonny, Sonny doesn't need to have this war. It's not worth the fallout. Look, he, he is willing to negotiate with Johnny. Do you really think that's gonna happen? I got a situation that... No, no, don't mind me. Finish your message. I'd love to hear about this uh, situation. 